Well, we're back at it again. Another Wet Nose Wednesday. We're here at Pause with Kelly and Kaz, the night host at 1069. And this time, we're here to uh, see if we can get some more friends to be adopted. And we have Jax here, who is a very friendly, friendly and very pretty cat. This is kind of a, he's got a unique look to him. And I want to tell us about Jack real quick. So Jax, what I'm sorry. I Yeah, what I know about Jax, J-A-X, so it's a Jax, um, is he's six years old, and um, he's certainly not suffering from shyness, that's true. And uh, he seems to be a mix of um, um, gray tabby and Persian, and he has a, uh, uh, he's very friendly, as you can see. Uh, you, uh, you and I have just met him for the very first time, and he's certainly not suffering from any shyness. No, not at all. I can see that. <laughs> and uh, Je I'm not sure what he's doing there, but uh, beautiful cat. So if you're looking for a, a new uh, family uh, member there, Jax is a, is a great cat to, to take home. You can see he's very friendly. And as Kelly said, this is the first time we've, we've met Jax, and is very just open, just wants to be touched and cuddled and all that good stuff. And he wants his family. He wants to find his family. So our next friend is uh, Lou Ellen, who has a very, another unique look, very linkish, you were yeah, saying? Very yeah, she's Very pretty, very friendly, very curious, and also very friendly, as you can see. <laughs> Loves to play, is in a playful mood right now. Uh, Kelly, wants to tell us about um, Llewellyn real quick. Llewellyn's about four years old. Um, we don't know much about her. She came in um, as a stray and we're still getting to know her but as you can see she's not lacking in a lot of energy <laughs> and looking for that perfect person who's got tons of energy but is going to give her a safe environment where she can grow old. She's, she's really young and um, she's got a long life ahead of her so uh, and when you get a good close look at her you just see how beautiful she is. Very pretty cat and very uh, friendly, as you can see, and it's good for kids. Uh, oh, yeah, absolutely. And you know, she would get used to someone's home and uh, the rules in that home, and uh, she'd be a great cat, a great companion for somebody with energy uh, who wants to spend time with her. Absolutely. And real quick, we were talking about the uh, adoption fees. Can you speak on that real quick? Yeah, we're still in June, which means we're still in Adopted Cat Month, which means that all the adult cats' uh, adoption fees are waived mm. thanks to Road to Puppy Bowl mm. throughout June if you adopt during the week. There you go. So let's see if we can find Lou Ellen at home and uh, become another family member. Come on, Ellen. So our third and final friend is Mr. Kitty. I love that name. Appropriately <laughs> named, I think excellent name. Absolutely. He loves our cameraman <laughs> more than he loves us. It's very true. Come here, darling. Very, Mr. Kitty. Mr. Kitty looks very like fit, like works he's out. He's very sleek, isn't he? Yeah. And he's uh, very vocal. He likes to talk. And obviously, he started with a much longer tail than that. And somewhere uh -oh. along the way, he lost half of it. I wow. guess he'll tell you the story if you adopt him. Absolutely. And also, uh, to remind people that it is uh, Cat Adoption Month, right? It is. It's Adopt-A-Cat Month all through June. And so um, it's a great time to get involved with uh, taking an animal home if you've never um, thought of adopting an animal before. Adopting a cat during Adopt-A-Cat Month is a good time. And um, yeah. Absolutely. So this would definitely make a great uh, addition to the family. And of course, summertime is here, so the kids are out, so they'll be home to play with the pets. It is, it's summertime, which actually marks our annual fundraiser, Pazwa. There we go, talk about that real quick. Yeah, every year we have this hilarious and fun outdoor event called Pazwa, where about a thousand dogs get together, and all the dogs walk on behalf of all the animals in our care. Um, so Pazwalk's registration is now open at pazwalk.net and that's where people can go to register and start raising money for Pazwalk in August. Very cool. So there you go. Look for something to do this summer. Pazwalk. And then of course you can find all the pets that are up for adoption at paws.org. There we go. Mr. Kitty, let's see if we can find you a home.